What's up, my stranded friends? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Bermuda Lost Survival. All right, guys, I just want to say right off the bat that if you guys gave me any tips or anything on last video, I did not see it because I did these videos back to back, so I just wanted to let you know that. Number two, the compass is awesome. Man, I should have got this right away. I didn't I didn't know where it was. I didn't know it existed. I wasn't thinking about it, but um, yeah, the compass is legit. Right? Anytime you're using your raft, it just automatically brings out the compass, and that is just phenomenal. Now, you might be wondering why I'm heading northeast, back to Iron Iron Reef. I'm going to call it the Iron Reef. Well, the reason I'm heading to the Iron Reef is simply because I need iron, okay? Uh, we are. We, there's a couple things we can make uh, today. Um, the one thing I wanted to make was the smeltery. Uh, the problem with the smeltery is it takes clay. Now, there is, area, there is one area in my reef place that has clay. Uh, the problem is it's going to take a while to farm it up because you have to grab some, wait for it to respawn, grab some, wait for it to respawn. I'm hoping I don't have to deal with clay today. I really, really do. Um, but apparently the anvil will allow you to make the mill and the mill will allow you to make dirt and I'm hoping the dirt will allow me to farm. That's, that's, that's the hope. That's what I'm hoping for. So we'll have to see how that goes today. Uh, I'd like to do some building. I, you know, game might be a little grindy i'm starting to wonder i'm starting to wonder um i'm having a good time with it don't, don't get me wrong i'm having a good time with it um and maybe some of you guys don't mind the grind honestly i don't mind the grind either um the thing that i do mind is i'm making a youtube video series and i can't you know spend hour and a half grinding for a 20 minute episode just you know so we'll see how it goes um so far it's not too grindy but it's you know starting to get there um the clay is going to be a real a real annoyance um so no i did not want to sleep thank you um, I wanted to save. My sanity's not looking good, but you know what? I could sleep 16 hours and it would barely do anything, so I'm not even going to bother. You know? I don't even know what's going to happen when my sanity goes down. Maybe I'll start losing hit points. I don't know. We'll just kind of have to, you know, see how things go with that. And we're going to be coming down here and looking for some... Oh, we got packages down here. I didn't notice these. Hold on. I did not notice these. Okay, well, this is a good find right here. All right. Oh, we got fish. Clay. Oh, ten, 10 clay. Oh, that's freaking great. Oh, my God. Oh, I just need five more clay. Now, that wasn't all the clay I'm going to need, but it's damn close. I... Okay. I think there's actually going... I think there's actually um, five clay uh, where my base is. Uh, the... the where my base is, like, off to the side, there is a deposit of clay. It's not deposit. It's not something you mine. It's just, like, clay, like, laying on the ground. And I believe there is five. I think there's also clay here. So I'm also going to look for clay here as well. I and mean, if you can find the clay here, that would really, really help. Go a long way um, towards making an excellent, excellent video. We'll see how that goes. Keep a lookout for clay. What I'm afraid now is that I'm going to, I'm going to see, I'm going to, like, pass the clay and not see it. Everyone's going to be like, Cage, you passed the clay. Oh my god. Now what does iron look like? Okay, that's what I thought. I thought I came out with more iron than I did. I only have like... I think I need like 15 iron. I think I have like 9 or 11 at home or something like that. I feel like I got more iron though. And maybe I... I don't know. Maybe I misplaced it. I'm not really sure. But we'll see what's what. Should we uh, break open some of these crates? I don't think we shall. I don't think we shall. So, um, remember, like, last time I was here and I died from, like, not being able to breathe and I thought it was a mine? Um, can the mines hurt you? Can anyone tell me? Because I really don't want to find out on my own. <laughs> you guys tell me because I don't want to find out on my own. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Can the mines hurt you? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, I kind of want to look for the clay at this point, to be honest. I'm going to keep an eye on our hit points. Because I'm wondering if we're going to lose hit points because of sanity. All right, we got to keep an eye on that. Um, all right, let's see. Let's see if we can find some clay now. Now, this is a pretty big area and it's pretty deep, so I don't think I, w I honestly I don't really think I want to be looking around for clay. It could take a long time to find it, and I know there's definitely some at my base, and I kind of have an idea where it is, and it's nowhere near as deep as the um as this area. So, I think we're just gonna grab some more uh, iron and GTFO. I'm so glad I found that. St found that stuff man those are oh iron's really weighing me down i didn't notice that obviously obviously bro it's iron it's iron bro do you even iron bro oh is this oh are these fish i can catch let's see if these are fish i can catch and eh, you know what i don't have what i need for the buoy right now actually actually i kind of do i really should mark out the fish here 
But I want to get back home and start building. Ah, but we need to eat. We need to eat. Eh, hit points are still fine. By the way, I um do this and this and this and this and this. There we go. I think your sanity should go up when you eat and drink. I mean, what what could give you more of a moral boost than eating and drinking, right? In this kind of situation? I mean, I'm supposed to cook fish. Like, that's stuff that you pay for in, in, like, in a restaurant right now. So, like, if you can get that for free and you're in a survival situation, I think that would I think that'd give you a pretty big boost, honestly. So, all right, let's see what we got here for the buoy. It's getting dark already, isn't it? All right, let's throw that in there, throw that in there. Nope, I didn't bring any wood. I mean, I could grab some wood and stuff, but I'm not, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Should I go home now or should I look for some more iron? I'm going to look for a little bit more iron. But we're, we're not going to do the uh, buoy right now for the fish. I'll do that some other time. Is that iron? No. No, I don't see any iron. Just a bunch of sulfur. Probably more iron around here somewhere, but... Stupid shark. Hate you. Alright, I'm not seeing any iron here, so... I don't know. Problem is, it's so deep down. Like, it's not... Actually, it's not that deep, but it's deep enough. And you just move so damn slow down here. Come on. Come on, iron. Okay, I'm really not seeing it anymore. I kind of want to go home. Well, I'm trying to craft something here, but apparently my workbench is full. Obviously. So let's grab some stuff out of here. I don't know what we can grab. Let's grab this. And obviously we're going to grab that because we're going to place it down. We'll take the terracotta out. We'll take, uh, I don't know, whatever that stuff is. And this and this. Okay, that looks pretty good. We'll also put this over here. And we'll grab that as well. Alright, throw some of these in the chest. There, 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 there. That's sulfur, by the way, and that's salt. So, alright. So what we're going to do now is we're going to see if we can put this uh, standing torch on the raft. Um, I don't think we can, but, you know, I'm all for trying. Why not? Um, blocked. Blocked. All right, it says it's blocked. Okay, well, that's interesting. Yeah, I guess you can't. Well, we'll put it right there. Why not? There we go. Now you guys can see. All right, so what we're going to do is now is we are going to go ahead and we're going to make ourselves an anvil. No, we're not, because we don't have something. What the hell are we missing? That's iron, right? Oh, we have to smelt the iron. Holy moly, I can't believe I didn't see that coming. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. Let me go find some clay. <laughs> well, guys, it's a brand new day, and I'm probably starving. Uh, well, actually, not really. Just kind of thirsty. There we go. Got some water. I love it. Water is one thing that is not an issue, and that is a wonderful, wonderful thing. Okay, so... Which way is this? Which oh, I still have food in here. I totally forgot about that. Which way do I think this uh, this clay is? I think if that's the fishing place, I want to say the clay is this way. I don't know. I just kind of have a feeling. Now I know what I'm looking for with the clay. I actually found it like on video, like a few videos ago. I even mentioned. It. I was like, "Yeah, that's clay. That's going to be important." Um, you know, I did make a buoy, so when we do find it, we are going to mark it. And it is not this way. It's definitely on the outside of the reef. And what we're looking for is like a little overhang, like a little rock overhang, like kind of like a little, like kind of like a little rock tunnel. Right? That's what we're looking for. I'll know it when I see it. And that'll be the clay. I believe I'll have enough clay there uh, to make the um, the smeltery as well, because there's gonna be uh, um, there's gonna be five clay there, I believe, and I already have ten. Um, man, finding that that like whatever it's called, wreckage, uh, whatever it was, whatever that whatever that I found, that like supply thing at the other reef, that was um, yeah, that was legit. That was legit. So let's continue looking around here. It's really nice that the sharks don't bother me. Unless I'm trying to eat fish. I think that's kind of realistic, too. Because I think for the most part, sharks do not prey on humans. Um, a lot of times... I mean, I don't know. What do I know? I don't know anything. Uh, but from what I've heard in my um, my research... And by research, I mean picking this up through movies and television. God knows where else. Um, is that the fact that sharks don't really uh, hunt humans. If they Usually when they, when they attack a human, it is a uh, mistaken identity. They think you're a fish. Right? So, I don't know. Maybe it's true. Maybe it's not. What the hell do I know? 
Uh, I don't see anything down there of any interest. So let's get on up here and let's take a breath. And wait for our breath to come back and then dive again. We'll get there, guys. We'll get there. I know it's I know it's on the outskirts. I'll, I'll find it. I'll find it eventually. It's really nice of the aliens not to be shooting at me as well. Oh, wait, supplies. Supplies. Come on, give me some more clay. Give me some more clay. Come on. Beautiful. Ten clay. Rotten fish. That was the same exact one I got last time, huh? Three torches. Oh, it's just wonderful. Just wonderful. We're going to make a smeltery today, fellas. That's what I'm talking about. And ladies. Don't want don't to have the ladies feel left out. Guys, girls, people, my peeps, my my cagers. What, what do I gotta call you guys? I need a name for my for my viewers, so I don't have to keep saying guys, girls, fellas, women, boys, girl, like the whole thing. I need a I need a gender gender neutral freaking thing for you guys, people, ladies, men, women, girls, everything. All right, so let's go ahead and save. Here we go, and let's go ahead and dump this stuff in here. I don't even know if I'm gonna need any more. Is that clay? Oh. See, I don't know what stuff looks like. Because it's like, it's not really properly titled. So I think that that supply thing that I just got, I think will refresh every day or two. So I'm able to go there for food quite often. Which would be pretty nice. I should have marked it. Damn it. I was so excited to get back. Um, no, really, where's the clay? I put it in here, didn't I? Yeah. Wait, did I already have 20 clay? I might have already had 20 clay. That's weird. Yeah, whatever. Who cares? Let's go. Let's get going. I'm not going to worry about it. We have it now. That's all that matters. Uh, stone. We need 12 stone. Son of a... Success! All right, I found three stone. Big freaking success, Cage. You're a real, you're a real freaking success, let me tell you. Enjoy those three stones, my man. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I was like, ah, oh, three stones. You're killing me. But, yeah, whatever. Three stones ain't nothing. It ain't no thang. Climb up that. And let's go ahead and drop them in here. And hopefully this is the last thing I need. I think it is. There we go. Yay! We can make a smeltery! Woo! All right. There we go. Let's take that. And we're starting to run out of room here. But that's all right. We'll make it. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. It's not about building right now. It's about getting stuff going. You know what I mean? Um, although I guess it's, you can kind of call this building, but not really. This is more like, you know, crafting type stuff. All right, so I'm assuming that runs on... Actually, that might run on... That might run on wood or it might run on coal. Let's see. Actually, I'm going to I'm gonna try wood even though I kind of want to do coal because I'm just kind of curious if it'll run on wood. Uh, put that in there and split the stack. We'll just take two... Nope, see, it even looks like clay. Okay. All right, then. Split the stack. 15. There we go. So now we're going to be smelting up some iron. Smelting some iron. All right, well, while that's doing its thing, let's drop this stuff in here. Uh, I don't really want anything else in there. Let's put this stuff in here. And... Okay, that looks good. All right, so how long is that going to take? Eh, it looks like that's going to take a while. I wonder how many it takes, you know, for one uh, run. Right now we've got 30. It's weird that it didn't take 30, right? It's just, it's still at 30. Am I doing this right? Usually, usually what will happen is it'll take a piece or two and then put it in, like, to be made. But I'm starting to wonder if I'm doing this wrong. That's, I mean, that's iron. I don't know what else I would do. So in order to uh, cook the iron, you need the bellows. And in order to get bellows, you have to cook down some plastic. All right, I'm going to need three chunks of plastic. All right, so you put the plastic in the smeltery, you use the, the coal just like I did with the iron, except, you know, you need the bellows. Uh, is it, does it tell you somewhere in this game any of this information? I, I kind of feel like it should, right? I mean, you can always come to KJ48 and learn how to do this stuff. That's true, but, you know, I, I kind of think that this stuff should be um, explained a little bit better. Um, you know, so anyway, we're going to make the bellows in the regular crafting bench, and it should be right about there. There you go. And uh, I think that's all I need for the iron ingots, but I don't really know. Because, you know, <laughs> there might be something else going on. And you can see, I'm assuming the bellows goes right here. You know, I think the idea is um, you need to get the smeltery hotter. You know, like plastic can burn or it can melt a lot at a lot lower of a temperature. 
right? So, yeah. And uh, I think for iron, you uh, you would want to get it, you know, hotter. And bellows, that's what they do. They get things hot. They make it hot. You know what I'm saying? I wonder what I'm going to need the pan for. See, a lot of the fermentation tech, I don't know what any of this stuff's for. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go ahead and put that in here. Here we go. I wonder if it'll make it cook the plastic quicker. That'd be nice too, right? All right, so now we're gonna grab the iron and put that in here as well. Will it do both at the same time? I don't freaking know, probably not. But we're just gonna let it cook a little bit. And uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab more of that. And we should probably cook some more fish. Can you just burn wood? Just, I wonder if I could just burn wood um, in order to get uh in order to get uh, coal, charcoal, or whatever. I don't know. Let's find out. All right, guys. This stuff's going to take forever to cook. I went ahead and cooked up all of the plastic. And now we have the iron going along. And what you want to do is just sleep. Just sleep. Just sleep for an hour here and there. And, um, you know, that'll pass some time. Like, right like this. Just make sure there's enough fuel in there to last an hour. And, oh, there you go. All right. And uh, sleep one more time. And that should be the last of it. I should have 16 pieces. Oh, 15 pieces. Okay. All right, there you go. And did this thing make me any charcoal? It did. So that's nice. Thank God I can make charcoal without having to cook fish. I mean, it wouldn't make sense if you had to have it, but you never know. You never know. All right, so now let's go ahead and make an anvil. There we go. All right, we're getting some stuff done today, people. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, so let's uh, take that thing out of there. Okay. And now let's place down the anvil. Construct! Uh, uh, yeah, right there's fine. Why not? Why not? Alright, so what can we make in the anvil? That's it? So someone said the mill. I'm guessing they meant the mortar and pestle. I'm gonna need five more iron. Son of a biscuits. Uh, okay, so, yeah, someone said you need the mill, but, again, I think they just, I think they meant, I can't scroll down or anything, so I'm thinking they meant the mortar and pestle, but I'm going to need more, um, more iron. God darn it. All right, well, I'll go back and get some iron in the morning, or is it the morning? What time is it? No, I'm going to sleep through the night, and then I'll go back and get some iron. And through the power of editing. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. All right, let's go ahead and cook this sucker up. All right, so this is what we do. We sleep for... Two hours! So that's 18. Uh, okay, so two hours does eight. Okay, let's try and remember that. Um, also, let's go ahead and drink and eat and drink and eat. Two hours equals eight. So there we go, another two hours. And that should just be a couple left now, right? Oh, none left, okay. Might have wasted some there, but that's okay. All right, so there we go, we got the iron. So let's take the iron. And go ahead and make ourselves a... What the hell are we making? I don't freaking remember. Uh, oh, no. We need to go in the anvil. That's right. The anvil. Come on. Get the iron out of there, dude. All right. So what do we need in the anvil? We need uh, planks, iron, and terracotta. Planks, iron, and terracotta. What the hell does terracotta look like? Um, all right. Well, we know what planks looks like. And... Terracotta, that's terracotta, I think. I only have 11 pieces. I feel like I should have more than that. Kind of feel like that with a lot of these, um... A lot of these items. I only have this much? I feel like I should have more than that. Alright, well, whatever. We can make the mortar, mortar now. I'm assuming this is what people were talking about by the mill. Maybe it was actually called the mill at one point, and they changed it to the mortar. I don't know. Um, this seems like the kind of thing you would use to grind down, um, you know, seaweed into dirt. So let's see if we can do that. Okay, and that looks pretty good to me. Okay, there we, there we go. All right, yep, okay, let's go grab some seaweed. I don't think you guys have seen me get seaweed yet. Or if you have, you haven't seen a lot of it. Well, let's go grab some seaweed together. We're gonna do it together, guys. We're gonna be a team. We're gonna be a team, Team 848. We really need to come up with a name for you guys. We, we, we used to call, I used to call you guys the Cage Rangers, but I don't know if I really like that. You know, like all the big YouTubers out there are like Cage Nation or whatever the hell they call those people. Um, yeah. yeah, we need something like that. All right, so that should be good enough, I guess. And we will take this up here and do some grinding. 
We need to expand the base as well. If this works, if I can actually, like, live off of, um... You know, if I can actually live off of the plants I grow, then I'll really start building. I want to start building, but I can't because, you know, I'm so worried about food, you know? Uh, mortar, crafting. Oh, there we go. Oh, black powder, dynamite, black powder, sulfur, charcoal. We can make dynamite. That's got to be another episode, though. Oh, okay, that's a torch. I was wondering what the hell those were. All right, well, let's go ahead and make some uh, seaweed, craft all, why not? Or some soil, why not? Go ahead and craft all. I wonder how much we're going to need. Because we should be able to put soil in here and what, like water or something? I don't know. Probably water. Let's go ahead and grab some soil. Um, grab some water. All right, guys, we have planted our first seeds, I'm assuming. I think we had six in there. I didn't count. But as soon as I put this in, um, it took five soil. And when I put in... By the way, I tried to use it with... Um, I was saving uh, salt water because I thought maybe salt water would work, but it doesn't. So we could just do this. You don't really need the salt water. You need, you need clean water. And as soon as I put the clean water in there, this thing started doing its thing. So I don't know what we're going to get from it. Um, the only thing I'm worried about is are we going to get more seeds or do we have to keep farming seeds? That, that's one thing... I'm, um, I'm a little, uh, unclear with, um, so, you know, that's cool though. We got that thing going. Let's go ahead and save the game. And while that's doing its thing, we'll go out and do some more farming. Maybe look for some more seeds. I think you make fish soup and everything as well. I don't know. Maybe have to go. Somebody said like fish, sea, salt and water or something. And you can make some fish soup. Maybe I'll make some fish soup. That would be nice. I mean, I'm assuming fish soup would give you a lot more, by the way, that's going to be next episode, I think. Um, maybe make some dynamite. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking fish soup might be a good way to, uh, you know, get our sustenance back. And, uh, let's see where the old fishing hole is. The old fishing hole. Alright, so it's, well, let's get in the raft. There's no point in swimming out here. We got, we've got buoys. You take, you take the raft to your buoys. You don't go out there, you know, swimming around like some kind of commoner. We're, we're past that, people. Uh, but since we're up here, let's check this out. No, yep. all right. So it's gonna take a little bit. Let's put that in there too. All right, cool. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, guys. I went out and caught some fish, and then I looked up the recipe. Apparently, the recipe is you have to make the pan uh, to get all those cooking recipes. And there's cooking recipes like um, uh, you can make salad, seaweed, and tomato, which is actually 20 hunger and 20 health. That's actually really good. 20 hunger for basically one tomato and one seaweed. The thing is, how do you know what you're going to get from the plants? Is it just random? I'm guessing it's it's got to be random, right? That's the only thing I think of. But I'm going to go ahead and cook this fish up because, uh, well, it'll probably... Well, we can make the pan next episode. I'm not going to make it this episode because it's been a pretty action-packed episode. <laughs> a pretty busy episode. So uh, what do we need for the pan? Scrap and sticks? I mean, Jesus, we can make it right now. All right, the hell, they'll just make it right now. <laughs> Why not? Why not? I'm kind of curious. Uh, so let's take that. Let's take that. And let's put this down. Building. And we didn't take it out, did we? Of course we didn't. Wait, we didn't? No, we did. It's right there. Hmm. Oh, the pan probably goes in some kind of cooking thing as a tool? Is that what you think? I, I, don't, I don't know. That's actually a really good question. It doesn't go... It, I don't think it gets put down. Yeah, all right. So I don't know what to do with the pan. All right, I couldn't wait, so I looked it up again. It goes in here. So the pan goes in here. Okay, so now there's no recipe set, so we have to know what to put in here. All right, so seaweed and tomato we'd have to put in there. Um, we can also do stuff like fish soup. Fish soup is actually soup, seaweed, uh, sweet water. Um, although I'm not sure how to do sweet water. In the beginning, you can have that. Um, with the barbecue bucket, you can make roasted fish after planting tomatoes. Yeah, I don't see... Sweet water, it gives you 25 thirst. But I'm not sure how to make sweet water. I'll have to, I'll have to look into that. Is it just regular water or... No. I guess it could be. I don't think it's, I don't think it's just regular water. Let's take some sticks and kind of mess around with this a little bit. Oh, look, the thing's actually on top. Cool. I like that, that it actually shows it on top. No. No, that's not doing anything. Okay. Yeah, I don't know how sweet water. I don't I don't see the recipe here for sweet water. Okay, well apparently sweet water is just regular water, I think. <laughs> I'm not really gonna know until one of you guys tell me. Or well it says sweet water is plus twenty five thirst on here. So I'm thinking sweet water is regular water, but let's take a look. Twenty five thirst. Twenty five thirst. Clean water. Okay. You guys should call it clean water. Sweet water makes me think you're putting it in with like 
I don't know, some kind of fruit or something. <laughs> but anyway, all right, guys. Um, this freaking uh, thing is taking forever, so I'm going to leave this alone. I'm going to go uh, get some more uh, seaweed, but what I'm going to do before we call this video is we're going to go to equipment. We're going to look for the improved knife because I will get a seaweed quicker. So that's 10 scrap, 15 sticks, 10 scrap, 15 sticks, a bunch of rope. Where's all the sticks? I think they're in here. No. Actually, did I cook all my sticks? I think I did. All right, whatever. Let's go ahead and make some more sticks. So I'm going to have to do some more farming. Uh, yeah, the farming is... It's borderland too much, but it's not quite... It's borderlands too much. No, it's, um, it might be a little too much. I don't know. It's, it seems okay. Um, it's a little grindy, but that's all right. We'll get, we'll get it done. We'll get it done. Let's go ahead and do that. Unlock. And now let's see how many uh, seaweed we get with the with the knife. I I'm thinking the seaweed is going to give us six because it usually doubles it. And I usually get uh, three per. So let's find some seaweed. Let's uh, harvest it up, see how much we get. And then we're going to call it a video. We got a lot done today, man. We made a lot of freaking progress, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and grab this. Oh, okay. Five. Yeah, I thought six would have been a lot, but five is just fine. Five is just fine by me. We're going to use this to get some more soil. And we want to keep those uh, plants uh, growing. I don't think we're going to get seeds back from the plants either, which is a little annoying. Um, I think you should get seeds back, although I could see how that would make the game a little bit too easy. But, you know, we'll see what's what. Anyway, guys, if you haven't enjoyed the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.